my music is everything to me. <laughs> like my music is my life. How I do music is literally everything about me. My personality, my humor, and my thinking is basically my music. So if you hear me on a song or you hear me making music, just know that I'm just doing me. The fact that when you're listening to my music, you don't know what to expect. You can be listening this minute and the next minute you're like, what, he's doing this and he's doing that. I think it's, that's it for me. But that says how I write my music. I don't have restrictions. I don't, I don't look to be a particular person or a particular artist. I like to be anything on the mic. Nigerian music, <laughs> to, be, to be particular, it's global now, it's everywhere. And the competition is hard. So what I'm trying to say is, I think fonts is, is the major challenge for every upcoming artist. Because you really need fonts. Even, I think, for the song I heard first, he said, um, even talent need promo. Even real talent girls still need promo. So that is just it. No matter how good you are, you need to put it out there for people to see, say, ah, this is what I have and this is what I'm selling. That person will open shop, you open shop, never tell people say see what they sell. You just they put AC, they put they put fan, they put everything. Nobody will come now because you never tell anybody to see what they sell. So I think it's one and the same thing. Artists at the top. I think likes of Alamide, Whiskey, the Davidos, the Technos. I think it's the ability for them to evolve the time. We've come a long way. People like, you know, LD the Don, Terry G, the P Squares, the Two Faced, the Whiskey, the Rema, the current um, Rema, Fireboy, you know, the wave of the movement. But I think what the ones at the top, let's say 10 years, who have been at the top for like 10 years or so, do differently is the fact that they, they, they are evolving with their sound. In as much as they're evolving, they're staying true to their sound. Because a lot of artists I've, I've witnessed or I've seen trying to evolve. They're trying to evolve with a new sound, but they're not staying true to their self. They're not being original. I think what makes them stand out is they're evolving with the sound but they're staying true to yourself. So I think that answers the question. Nah, <laughs> Afrobeat is just starting, trust me. I think there's a lot of things we're yet to do with Afrobeat. Yeah. There's a lot of things we're yet to discover about Afrobeat. So, no, Afrobeat is just starting, and the world will hear them. I don't really have a particular routine for making music. I just go with how I'm feeling. However I feel on any song, or however I feel, whatever kind of song I feel to write, I write. I'm not stuck on, I want to write love songs, I want to write happy music. I just like to go with how I feel. So, I just trust the process and trust my instinct. That time would they come up now. I would they try the with the with the with the day our our normal area the sing song. I think they used to say we gas high before we could perform. So if we know high, say people no go feel us. I think that's the worst advice I've received because a lot of people say if I know high, nobody will feel you, bro. Nah, I don't agree. I think you can, you can still make people feel you regardless. That should be, don't look at anybody. Just do what you're doing. Looking at people will create an image in your head. And when you start to create images in your head, you will like to match those images. And if you can't match those images, you begin to lose confidence in yourself. So I think when you're doing you, you begin to grow your confidence on your own. And when you're able to grow your own confidence, it will be very difficult to put you down. I think they should share their story a lot more. 
their success story you know because i think a lot of upcoming artists don't really understand that it's a process you know i know a lot of people who have given up on their dreams because of you know one or two things thoughts like i don't feel i don't feel and all you know but when you begin to listen to success stories of blown artists i think some of them do but i don't think they share it enough for people to understand person could just hustle one two three he could say i don't try i don't do again but i believe if they share it a lot more people will begin to see that okay there's more to this than just dropping one or two songs and saying um, i've tried my best i think there's a lot more to it how we go do now now to the work based on everybody won't, won't reach Jerusalem so I think it's still work be prayerful be diligent and be true to yourself everybody they hurt for the industry Kiss Daniel Olamide Whiskey ah, Dremel then plenty Magneto I'll shout out to these guys, man, because I they've been holding it down for some time now, and I want to let them know I've been listening to a lot of their songs and really feeling them. Hopefully, one of these days I get to jump on a song with any of them. Boymex, being some Boymo is not the same thing. I'm a dope artist without a painting. <laughs> Money is the root of all evil. Money be the main thing. Money is an entity. So try and make it get it. Your bank account is your identity. If you also hard, my brother, you won't regret it. Poaba. <laughs> I'm riding this track like a chaba. Nika in a sun waiting I taka. Baby Zoku Savana. Kizomu jemu kwaba. Kodo on god no mere. Debo on debo fere. Me no mere swing by the yare. Me no fetch your ball by the pele. I always do peaks and a papeti. Mon king yo, bon après-midi. Oh, yeah, pose for the boy, le garçon. Come see. Come ça. When I step up in the booth, le bâton. They don't beg. Sorry, sir. Oh, shit. Ça va être Oh, bless you, the long way like that. 